I also love how the worms go into instant rigor mortis. It was Lazarus. Of that I am certain. He alone had the king's ear and whispered dark and evil magic. Ooh, dark and evil magic. Instilling the notion of an imminent attack by Westmarch. Afraid to speak against the Archbishop, the councillors nodded their empty heads in agreement and sent us off to die. Sounds like modern day government. We could possibly, maybe, at some point in the near future, be attacked. Preemptive strike! <laughs> oh, politics. There's a reason I'm a poli side major. <laughs> Map, and we're good. Okay, next. I, with my spear of poking of shockingly pokiness am going to go to the next level yes run rat run for you will tremble before me it's Deckard Kane! Smash. The skeleton king? The power of the born star will <laughs> And soon all will suffer as I have suffered. Gods, bring me his bones. No, Deckard Kane! Here I come to save the day. Hey, I will save you. Help. I'm helping. Oh, you're a big one, aren't you? Oh god. And also kind of a suckish one. Can I use that? Oh, but it sucks. Hello, Deckard Kane. Oh, thank you, but why did you risk your Because I'm awesome. You live. Fortune smiles on you, old man. I'm here to leave <laughs> Oh, it is wonderful to hear that Leah is That's alive. That's great. I fear the worst. I learned of this secret passage through old... Through old maps I found. Okay, I was busy looting. Sorry, it's what adventures do. <laughs> Cathedral Garden. Ooh, a chest. We must discuss the fallen star. Right. Follow me to Tristram. You say that like it's so cool, and yet. Oh, whoops. D. There we go. And yet, let's be quite honest here. It's, it's not really. Zeppy Zeppy. And to New Tristram. Ooh, cutscene. I have fulfilled my promise to Leah and rescued her uncle, Deckard King. Now, all that stands between me and the fallen star is the Skeleton King who has returned to darken Tristram once again. This guy gets it. The parent. So, um, yeah, talking. Uh, so, from what I understand, that guy gets his ass handed to him often. Lame, lame, Prentice Boots. Ooh, aw, oh, any magic material. Well, then, magic material. One dick. <laughs> and so I shoot my pew pew laser beam. <laughs> Doug, I worked my hands to the bone to bring you these. That's goods. great. Take all my useless junk. I don't want it. Uh, no, no. No, no, no. Give me some better stuff. Jeez. And it is written, a fire will all right. Woohoo! Thanks to you. Leah well, did nothing. Here. Our time is running short. What can you tell me about the Fallen Star? 
Not much, I'm afraid, though the prophecy of the end days surely points to it as a sign that the end has Dun dun dun! Please, Uncle, not more of your stories. All that matters now is that you're back. Yay! Next. The Skeleton King was once our beloved lord, Leoric. He was driven mad by Diablo. That's too bad. He lost both of his sons and his very soul before he was finally defeated. Now it seems he's risen to plague this land once Do go on. Leoric's tale is sad, but I'm here to find the fallen star. And the skeleton king stands Ergo, he head. dies. The key to defeating him lies in his old crown. Seek out our blacksmith, Hadrig. He knows of its whereabouts. Sounds like something that we should keep around. Leah, you should not dismiss the signs so lightly. Do you not believe the Oh, hey, you moved your cart. So this is how it ends? They dragged my cart from the road, but for what? I can't get it repaired. Might as well dig a hole and yep. die in it. If that will make you feel better. <laughs> yes, yes. Each of my items is very special to me, but I suppose I can sell you one or two things if I must. Yeah, you don't have anything I want. Leah spent all night alongside the blacksmith's wife. What? <laughs> Did you hear? Old Rumpton has us down to all. No, oh, it's coming to Shen! Very interesting topic. <laughs> I sell jewels. Ooh. Well, I suppose that could be interesting. What are you doing so far from Shionside? The women. Young ladies chasing me around day and night, begging for a kiss. <laughs> I had to leave. It was the only honorable What a thing pimp! To do. I somehow feel that you aren't being entirely truthful with me. Truth? Never touch the stuff. What a boss! I love him. It could just be because he's the goose from Kung Fu Panda, but whatever. <laughs> you are very brave to venture outside the town gates. Uh, I hear there are all sorts of dangerous things crawling around out there. If you consider the Walking Dead dangerous, then I suppose I'm too much of a badass to do that. Oh, oh that's terrible! I only meant the rats and snakes. You wimp! You make jewels that are awesome, and yet... Hmm, I do like this Descartes Cain fellow. It's rare that I can find someone I have so much in common with. You two do not seem very similar. We both had rather interesting experiences with the Zacharone princesses in our youth, so... <laughs> oh god, he's so great! I'm glad we get to have him the entire time now. Oh, you know, there's nothing in the world quite so perfect as jewels. <laughs> they have color, size, shape, transparency. Trans transparency. Oh, yes, if only I could eat them, I would need nothing else in life. Uh, not that you can't. I hear some people even shave certain crystals atop their food. Yes, it's called salt. It's delicious. Hello. Blacksmith, Deckard Kane said you could help me find the crown of Leoric. No, no. That's my wife. She's locked in the cellar like all those who've been bitten. I'm to put them all down. But how can I kill my own Yeah, can you use your scoldishness? I know it will be difficult, but she would want you to do it. I will help you. Thank you. Follow me. I took no convincing at all. I have to kill my wife. Go do it. Okay. Pachu. I'm not. Wow. <laughs> the wizard's awesome. He's just like, why do you feel sorry? Don't. They're, they're all dead. Pachu. 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 Oh come on. Mira, my love. Forgive me. <laughs> uh, hey, Rick. Help me. Please. 
No, God, everywhere. No, leave me alone. No, leave me alone. Pew. No. Not that. How dare you? Adrian, kill your wife. God, you made me do it. 